Okay, happy new year, you guys. This is so awesome. I'm so excited. I hope everyone had an amazing holiday. Thumbs up, round of applause. We made it to 2022. So I am broadcasting live and on the Zoom link. So if you see my eye contact going like this, that's what's going on. And I'm gonna to try to watch questions and vote. Um, so many great questions. Everyone get comfy. Thanks for joining. Um, I'm throwing the shoes off guys so we can really get cozy here. And I am so excited to talk skincare talk all things and I have lists and lists of everyone's questions and pop in with anything new so we're going to dive right in I'm going to try to keep this class to about 30 minutes um, if you have to jump out no worries no big deal I'll try to save this as well and let's get started so I hope everyone had an amazing holiday and just time with your family we as a team took the entire week off for the first time between Christmas and New Year's and it was so nice it was just such a great like mental reset and fun with the family. Um, I got a lot of questions about where we went. We went to Bora Bora last week and it was so fun and so crazy because, hey, you guys, hey, Faith Hope, hey, Tammy, um, hey, Megan, hey, Brittany, Carla, hey, you guys. Um, we honeymooned there. So it was so nuts being back with our three kids and um, someone said Halle Berry was there at the same time. I didn't see her. <clears throat> so that, there's the answer to that question. And it was just a beautiful time. The weather was amazing. It was so fun. And I'm just so grateful that we had that time really unplugged and just spent time as a family. So it was really, really lovely. Um, but drop in my chat, where did you guys go or stay or what did you do? Um, it was it was a really fun way to start 22. Who's feeling 22? I'm feeling 22. Okay, yeah, that is why I was not TS, okay? So let's dive right in. First question um, is, da -da -da -da. okay, does GlowPro help with acne? A hundred percent, so great. Why does it help? I want you to think of it as that kind of like vertical exfoliation. And here is, I know this is super gross. We're like diving into the gross straight away. Um, here's what happens. When you get a breakout, there's a confluence of three different things that happens, okay? And we all get them. Hormonal happens. And typically if a breakout is hormonal, it's along your jawline, like through here. If you're getting one that is from P. bacterium, so that's bacteria related, you know, here, here, wearing masks, it all happens. I mean, I, if you are like me, holla. I feel like I cannot get off a long flight and not have a breakout. It is the craziest thing. It happens to everyone, it's okay. So here is why GlowPro helps. The three things happen like this. Number one, you have bacteria. So, you know, don't touch your face because your hands are covered in bacteria, your phone. Every day I wipe off my phone with a sanitizing wipe. Um, so phone's another one, changing your pillowcase frequently. Hi, Gracie. Hi, Hattie. You guys can pop in and say hi. Um, can I just show you guys the cutest thing on the planet? Please take a look at this. Um, Gracie just said, um, we have to show everyone on Zoom. Come, Grace. Gracie just said, am I allowed to have a Jolly Rancher? This is happening. With my sh what this is, is happening. Thing? I love it. I love it. Yeah. Oh, no, that Jolly Rancher has sugar. So I you know. It's say hi tiny. Hi. Um, so, Super fun. Gracie decided for her January goal that she is not having sugar, but it's still sugar, baby, whether it's like this big or this big. I love her. Um, so uh, P. bacterium, so bacteria, number one. Number two is, uh, you guys, we're like, lit, like, this is my life. You know, it's all, all the things. I love it. It's super fun. Um, and I think it's so important. And we'll talk about this in a second, just as a mom to show your kids what it's all about. You know, I feel like when I was growing up, the generation was more like, just very separate, you know, work, career. To, and I think it's so great to always be on the same team as a family. And I, you know, we're, we just were at Michael's grabbing a science board experiment project and then, you know, head up to the office for a bit. And then we're just together as a team. So, um, all right, follow me, track with me. So P bacteria number two is buildup of dead skin. That's why exfoliation is so important. So you can imagine like desert sand, everything's kind of built up and then you introduce bacteria. And then the third prong, and it's just gross, but you're, you start excreting this kind of fat um, in the form of sebum or oil. It's usually a little bit thicker. So you have this confluence of dead skin buildup. So everything's trapped. Then you have, you know, the sebum coming and then you have the bacteria. And that is the recipe, my friends, for a breakout. So what can we do to help, right? Number one, let's eliminate the bacteria. Love our prep pads. I don't see any prep pads. Um, I know we've had super, been super limited on, on this. Um, if we can grab a prep pad, that'd be awesome. You guys know them. They kill P. bacterium. They even kill E. coli. They kill uh, yeast. It's 
they're pretty amazing. And I recommend using that on your face, whether you're glow prone or not. I travel with them with little travel ones and I'll swipe my skin after I get off the plane, you know, underneath the mask, cause you're breathing into that mask and then it's, you know, pushing it into your skin. It's intense. So swipe the skin. And then when you're done, that's when I would glow pro and the glow pro is going to help vertically exfoliate the skin. So then you have less dead skin, right? Cause you're pushing out that bouncy, beautiful new skin. And that is so helpful for breakouts. So if you feel a breakout coming and again, it happens to everybody, it's okay. What I do is I take a prep pad that has that steroglow peptide, swipe it on the area. Then you're going to glow pro, just glide it right over that area before it's open. Okay. Again, sorry, gross, but this is what you want to do before. Once it's then don't touch it. Okay. Um, then I take retinol because remember retin-A, retinol, it was developed in the late seventies for breakouts for acne. So it's really incredible for helping. So I'll put like phase three of R45 or, uh, the nightly I'll put it on. And then when I'm done, let that all drink in. And you can even swipe again later with the prep pad in the morning, just continuing to kill the bacteria, exfoliate that skin, and then putting, um, those great, like if you like different gel, it's retinol. That's what it is. So it's really amazing for anti-aging and for keeping the skin clear. Um, we have a lot of people who have used Glow Pro and R45 together that had cystic acne. I had one sweet gal who said, look, I've tried lasers, Accutane, everything. And her skin, I actually wasn't even sure it was the same person when she showed me a before image. So it's really, really incredible. And that's a great, great question and great solution. Um, question on, are we changing our packaging? Okay. So as you probably noticed, we have transitioned some of our artwork. So we're not changing packaging, um, but you will notice that we've made a little bit of transition on our labeling. So um, it's what we call a soft transition. So it's totally fine if you get um, a product that has either either one, collector's edition. Um, half of mine is one, half is the other. And I love it. They're all a family. They all look beautiful together on your counter, but that's a great question. And I'm glad that you guys are loving it. I've gotten lots of great feedback. Oh, thank you, Susan. That's so sweet. Um, Dana said, which is stronger than nightly or R45? So R45, um, the three phases, as we've talked about, your retinol should be yellow. So phase one, phase two, phase three. So even phase one is stronger than 0.05% retin-A, stronger than 1% over-the-counter retinol. So you're going to see results. And remember, it releases deeper in the skin. If you didn't do the R45 challenge, I did it at the end of last year. You can start now. This is a great time. Your skin will be gorgeous by Valentine's Day. And as the concentration increases, 50% stronger, then 50% stronger again. So this is boost. And each boost, each phase takes about two weeks. So at night, I glow pro my skin. Then I put on two pumps of this. Then I put on the quench and go to sleep. And then once it's empty, I recycle the container, move up to phase two, 50% stronger, then finish at phase three. Then nightly, any good derm skin expert will tell you there's kind of two philosophies or approaches with retinol, right? You either do a slow, low dose drip every single day, or you titrate up, just like on a birth control pill, you know, the, the levels increase um, as kind of a boost for the skin. And they're both great philosophies. That's why a good derm will start you on a 0 0.05 and then they'll move you up to, you know, a 0.2 and so on and so forth. So what's nice is you don't have to think about it. And again, look for that color yellow because you can't bleach retinol. So the nightly, if you even look at the color, it's really between like a phase one and phase two concentration. So you can think of it like this. So I'm using, I boost with R45 and then I go to the nightly for six months and then I boost again with R45. So if you're a runner, which I'm not, I wish I was, um, it's kind of like when you do a marathon. So think of R45 as your, your you know, foster marathon that you do a couple of times a year. You wouldn't get a laser treatment every day or a, um, you know, any type of a really intense treatment that's gonna work for you. And even if it's sensitive skin, I have the most sensitive skin, love, love, love R45. Um, then you'll do your, your maintenance. So in the morning, you're not running 20 plus miles, you're maybe it's three miles. So think of the nightly like that as your, you know, evening, evening run, if you will. So R45, and then I use the nightly in between and you can see that color. I know it's hard under the lights, but you can see it's that pale, pale yellow. I know it looks really bright here, but it's a pale yellow. And that's really important. So you can see once you get to the higher phases of R45, it's really incredible to, to watch that transition and watch the color change. I'll show you guys here. Um, oh, thank you, Suzanne. That's so sweet of you. So the packaging has always been gorgeous. I love that. 
I think I need another R45, Macy, darling. We're like at the bare bones here because this is like everyone's been coming by and using this. It's so good. We all were going nuts for the R45 day challenge. Um, so I'll show you guys the color changes in a sec, but I love this. Literally, that's like the final pump. Um, so shelf life of R45, Licia, it is two years. So two years unopened. So all of our packaging is airless packaging and the shelf life is two years. So there you go. Um, Elizabeth says, so if you do the nightly on a regular basis, do I use phase one um, and phase two? So just like we were talking about, I like to do R45 and then I do the nightly. So I'm doing my three, I'll show you one more time. So I'm doing my three phase boost. Then I'm doing the nightly. And then six months later, because your results last for about six months, a lot of people just like to use R45 back to back. Like think of it like an elliptical machine, right? And that's okay as well. But I'm a big believer in do as little as you can for it, you know, getting as much runway as you can. So you don't have to spend a gazillion dollars every day, right? So we know clinically that most people's results last for about six months. And you'll see it, you'll notice it in your skin, like the glow isn't quite as prominent on your cheekbones. And you're like, okay, it's time to boost again. Um, so I love this system because it's lazy skincare. You cannot do this with all ingredients. For example, you gotta wear sunscreen every day. Vitamin C is not something your body produces. Your body actually produces retinoic acid, which is vitamin A. And as we age, that level starts to decline like this. So that's why you can kind of fill up the canteen again. And it's something you don't have to do every day, but that's just not the case for every ingredient. Um, love this. That's why, you know, people that are on Accutane, which is a high, high, high dose of vitamin A, um, which I'm not saying that I advocate or I have a position on, um, that's why you can go on it and off of it. So it's really kind of a, a fun, you know me, I'm such a nerd that way. It's really a fun ingredient. So um, question next. Um, Haley says, I have trouble with the hair serum. Um, but trying to wash my hair every few days. What are some tricks to help with this? I have really thin hair. Okay, great question. So I'm obsessed with this. And in fact, I'll tell you, um, both of my girls, especially Aubrey, she sleeps on the side of the room where the heater's coming down. So her scalp is getting dry and it gets kind of itchy, right? So I've been using the scalp serum on her. I cannot even tell you what a game changer it is. There is a certain even strain. She obviously has dry scalp. If you have dandruff, that's a separate thing. And there's a certain strain of bacteria we've actually uh, been able to identify as an industry that is dandruff. And the rose bay extract and the um, zinc in here help to tackle that. So if you're someone that really bothers you, you feel like you have a flaky scalp, you'll love this on its own outside of the hair growth benefits. So to answer your question, Haley, um, you might be using a little too much if you're feeling it. It is such a weightless formula. You guys know that I am a perfectionist when it comes to formulation and I cannot use anything that I personally would not love and use. And it's really funny. Um, if you follow along, you know my morning routine, my nighttime routine. I do get questions sometimes like, do you use something else outside of Beauty Bio? I don't. You can ask anyone that has spent time with me in my bathroom. Literally, I use every single thing that you're using for my skin. And I spend maybe 120 seconds on my skincare routine morning and night. And that's always surprising to people. They're like, yeah, is it like a 20 minute long? It is so easy. It is the simplest routine. I won't go through it. So for scalp, you can do the scalp serum every day. I put it on last night. Last night I washed my hair and it's exciting. And I love to go, you know, put a little bit more on when my hair is wet. But one thing that was so important to us on this formula, weightless, Fragrance-free, you know that we're a clean skincare brand. So Sephora, Ulta, everywhere clean. And if you notice, on the first time you use it, you're going to need to give it a little extra squeeze like I just did. And then I am so in love with this component. You can literally drop, just like drop by drop out. And it is completely weightless. I mean, I can put it now on styled hair, just like this. And I just used an inch and a half inch a barrel roller. I got a lot of hair questions. Um, just like this. And it is completely weightless. My hair is not sticking to my scalp now. It still has lots of volume. It is awesome. So you can put this in morning and night. If you have a patch, so if you pull back your hair right now, guys, and if you can see your scalp anywhere, you're starting to experience the beginning of hair loss. It's going to happen to all of us. We lose collagen in our face, collagen in our scalp. So what's important is using our scalp roller on that spot. So say I had a spot here. Just one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five. That's it. Then immediately, because it's created those little micro channels, stimulated the collagen, then you immediately apply 
the scalp serum right after and it drinks into the skin. And that's the thing I love about microneedling, 200 times better absorption, 200 times. So if you can see your scalp and you're experiencing that hair loss, super important to use the tool first because this is going to like microwave your results so much faster. And in fact, my um, sweet trainer that I've been working with he just started, I'm like, take a before image. He's like, well, I was just using the scalp serum. I'm like, wait, that's totally cool. But if you really, since you already, you know, have some balding areas, if you really want to expedite your results, use it together. So I'll keep you guys posted. It's awesome. Um, Chloe on our team was showing me the cutest pic of her dad, who she said has been bald for 30 years. Men and women love this. Look, postpartum after three kids. I'm like, no one tells you all of a sudden your hair falls out. It happens to everyone. And it's so cute. She took me a picture and he has like a whole village. It's so awesome. And she said something funny. Like, she's like, oh my gosh, my, my fingers got tangled in my hair. There's so much now. Braid it. So cute. Okay. So guys, I'm doing something really exciting. You know, I always like, like to go rogue and do something fun. So I asked the team if for everyone who tuned in, if we could do something special. So before anyone starts shopping, we are doing a 22% off for 2022. Um, on our website. So this does not apply, unfortunately, to Sephora or Ulta or Nordstrom or Neiman's, just beautybio.com, 22% off anything site-wide with the code HELLO2022. Is that in all caps, HELLO20? Or... It, I don't think it matters. Okay, we don't think it matters. HELLO2022, so it shouldn't be um, cap sensitive. Um, awesome. Yay, I love it. I'm glad, Mary, that you love it. Perfect. Hey, how are you? Um, what lip gloss do I wear? So this is um, Soar by MAC is the lip liner. That's like my go-to. And then the lipstick is Cream Cup. And then the pout. And I love the pout. I'll see if I can grab one. It's our volumizing lip serum, 50% fuller lips. It is amazing. It is awesome, awesome. Um, I'll show you guys in just a sec. So you can see there's that kind of pale yellow color that I was showing you guys, you can see. So uh, compared next to... I'll show you like a bright white so you can see the difference. So when you're shopping for retinol, not to digress and go back, um, just look for that color because it's super confusing, right? Everyone's like, what percentage and 1%, 3%? Guys, just look at the color. You can see that's against white. So you can really see the difference there. You can see it's just a pale yellow. Okay, awesome. Now let's talk about, so hello 2022. Sorry, someone's asked again, hello 2022. Um, oh, I love that Kimmy said, um, love the pout and you need more of the dry shampoo. Are you guys freaking out? Can you believe that article um, with women's health? It was so amazing. So the editor, and thank you so much, um, did a full trial and tried all these different dry shampoos and uh, picked this is the best. And her before and after is insane. You have to look at my stories. I, I put it up. It's so awesome to see. And that's what makes me so happy. It's just so incredible to work so hard on technology and then to see people loving it. So thank you. Um, I'm glad you love it. So on the um, scalp serum, just a little bit. So just give it one little hug like that. And then I just give it a little tiny squeeze and you can see, see the little droplet right there. And then you can just use your finger to tassel it through. So just a little bit, you don't need a ton. So I think that um, to answer your question earlier, you know, am I using it right? That's a great way to use it. And people always are surprised on the roller. It's just five seconds, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five. It's super, super easy. All right. So let's jump into the pow. I have some people ask what the pow is. So it comes in a few different flavors and you can see there's that yummy uh, metal tip just like this. And then you just massage it on and it's made of hyaluronic acid. There we go. Hyaluronic acid and collagen. So as you glide onto this, to the lips, that just drinks into the lips. And then what I do is I put um, a lip color if you want on top and so that this can really drink in. And that's really interesting. So here's a pop quiz, you guys, answer if you know. Tell me, how do you apply your skincare products? Which goes on first? And this is always a tricky question for people. Here's how you can remember it. You're gonna apply your skincare from the thinnest to the thickest. So in the morning, you'll wash your face, your skin's pH should be five. Exactly. Good job, Nancy. Awesome. Good job, Tara. You guys are amazing. Maria, our skin deluxe. I love it. So you'll wash your face. Just a dime size amount. Obsessed with this cleanser. Love, love, love. It smells like spa eucalyptus. And you can see it is totally clear. Okay. 
and it's not going to foam like big bubbles. That's how you know that the pH isn't right. So you'll get a little bit of, you know, kind of like a whiteness to it, but there are no big bubbles happening. So that's important. And it also smells so good. Um, also gets rid of your eye makeup even. So you don't need a separate toner, eye makeup, face makeup remover. It's a lot. So easy breezy. Uh, I don't know if we have any of the jumbo size left on the website or not. That was really popular on holiday. This is the normal size, which is very generous. and will last you a long time. Um, I keep a big jumbo in my, frit, in my fridge, in my shower. And then I keep this one around my sink. So if you're someone that loves that. Oh, and another really crazy tip that Andrea on our team shared with me. This cleanser is amazing for the body. If you ever are going through a period of time where you've been working out in a sports bra and you have some congestion in your chest, amazing. She's like, Jamie, it literally cleared up, you know, a little situation going on. So back, chest, had no idea. So I love when you guys, when everyone shares pro tips. So dry shampoo, I'm going to show how to use this guys real fast. You're just going to shake it and then little sprays. Here's where most people go wrong with dry shampoo. They go like this, like this, and it just weighs the hair down. And then you're like, my hair is flat. It's crazy. Ours is starch free and alcohol free. The first ever. So we won a recent award, which I'm really excited about in the UK. Um, for sustainability, it is 70% reduction in VOC, which is awesome. It's like 2027 standards. Um, so it's great for the, so much better for the environment and um, it biodegrades, which is awesome. But what I love is, you know how when you cook with starch and it's like white and chunky and crazy down, that's why your hair always looks like, you know, a gray patch when you're using the dry shampoo. So this is bad because it's really clear, which is great. And it contains two and a half percent of follow grow. So it helps, it's actually good for your scalp. It's actually healthy, it actually helps your hair grow thicker, fuller, stronger when you use it. You know, when you use dry shampoo and you're kind of like cringy a little bit, like I know this is probably not great for me and you look at it and you scratch your head and there's like craziness underneath your fingernails and you're like, this can't be great. It is not great. Um, but look, I've used it as well, of course, until we developed this new formula and it smells so good. And um, so you just shake it, shake it, don't break it. And then just a little tiny burst. That's it. And I know it feels like it's not enough, but it will absorb the oil and then you're good to go. So let it settle for a second. Give it like 10 seconds to drink up the oil and then you could just shake it. And a lot of people on our team, which I love this again, pro tip. I learned so much from everyone is if you know it was supposed to be a wash hair day the next day, put it on your scalp at night and it drinks in the oil at night. It's so bad. Eh? It's awesome. All right, so moving on, we have lots of questions and I feel like I'm going too slow. Um, does Glow Pro help with pores? 100%. So you're forcing new baby skin, like the skin you see here, this is not the same skin that was even here a month ago. As we age, our cellular turnover goes like this, right? Just slowly declines. In fact, from a collagen, which is kind of elasticity perspective, you lose 1% of your collagen production a year after the age of 18 like crazy, right? And I know it sounds depressing, but we can manually trigger and do what our body used to do when we were younger. So when you glow pro at night, so at night, here's my routine. I wash my face with a cleanser. Then I take a prep pad. These are little prep pads we were talking about. Thank you, Macy. And then I just swipe it all over my skin, grab one. And they're so juicy. Like you guys can see there's so much juice in them. That's all of that juice killing the P bacterium. So again, I travel with these and after I get off a plane and you've been breathing in your mask, just swipe on your skin. So you'll just swipe all over, just like this. Now I'm ready to glow pro. Where did my glow pro go? Turn it on. Batteries last for two plus years. So it's so nice, you don't have to charge it. So then you just take it and then I just glide over the skin, just like this, all over. And here's a little tip. If you have the eye attachment head, and you just put your attachment heads on and off like this, there's a little button on the back. If you have the eye attachment, it's a little bit narrower than this one, depending on your nasal shape, just you can kind of pull it aside and then just get in there with your Glow Pro. You guys, it is so good for your pores. I cannot even tell you, so good for your pores. Tightens the pores because as you're pushing out that new skin, new skin like baby skin doesn't come back with wrinkles and spots and craziness, right? It's perfect. Think about like muscle memory, right? It's cellular memory. So you're not gonna start, even though microneedling helps to grow back hair, you're not gonna grow hair out of the middle of your cheek, right? 
because every cell is designed beautifully um, and kind of pre-programmed to do what it's going to do. So don't worry um, about that. A lot of people have messaged me about how Glow Pros helped their eyebrows to grow back, which is awesome. Did you guys read that Chrissy Teigen had an eyebrow hair transplant? Like that's the coolest technology, right? Uh, for everyone that grew up in the kind of like 90s, early 2000 era when the brows were super thin. Um, but another alternative is to Glow Pro. And one of my plastic surgeon friends, who's a huge Glow Pro advocate, he said, you know, obviously you don't want a microneedle on your lids because they're five tissues thin. Um, super, super thin skin, but take it on the brow bone right here. So not only will it help your brows to grow back thicker and fuller, it helps to uplift your lids. So that's an amazing, amazing tip to just do that. So don't forget your forehead, 11 lines as well. So good. So all over jaw, neck, decollete, everything. And then now your skin, just like if you're a gardener, is ready to absorb 200 times more effectively. You guys, I know you've seen me do the demonstration before, so I won't do it, where I can show you, you can do it on half of your face, back of your arm. And it literally creates these little invisible microchannels that not only triggers the wound healing response to make new, beautiful skin, but for about five minutes and your body heals really quickly. The older you get, the slower it is, but about five minutes. So don't like change a diaper, walk the dog immediately after you glow pro. Don't like freak out about it, but like right after that's when you put on your skincare. So for me, I would put on, I'm going to grab the nightly. That's what I'm doing right now. Cause I just finished our 45, do the nightly, a couple of pumps of the nightly fingertips. And then I just glide it all over my skin like this. And you notice guys, I even took it underneath the eye area, which you can do because this is a deeper release retinol. So it's not going to freak your skin out, which is awesome. And then when I'm done with that, then I would apply the quench cream on top. And I'm going to show you, I'll show you guys this on the back of my hand so you can see the texture. I am obsessed. And you know the story of the quench. This is ceramide rich. So, you know, you see all of these like crazy $500 ceramide facials and so forth. This is made with four different natural lipids, two ceramides. It is so yummy. So again, as we age, think of this like the mortar between your skin cells, right? Ceramides, so important. And as we age, imagine if you stacked bricks with no mortar in between. That's what happens as we age, which is why I'm like, why do I get off of a flight, you know, 10 hours to Europe or wherever. And my skin is so dry, but my daughter's skin is not. Like what the heck happens as we age? Ceramides and loss in that natural hydration. And it's not enough just to add more humectants and so forth. It really is to so identify the exact lipids that you lose as you age and you have them here in this cream. And this is a big Total Beauty Award winner, which I love. So I can put this on. And after a 12 hour flight, look at that. My skin literally looks radiant like this. Like it is such a game changer, especially if you live in like California, Utah, somewhere that's a really arid, dry environment, you will love, love, love this formula. Love it. So I know we have a lot of brand fans with this formula. Thank you, Tan France, um, who's in Utah, who spread a lot of love around the quench. It's just such a great formula. So then I put that on after the nightly. And if your skin's super, super dry, you guys, you can totally do the quench in the morning too. A lot of people do that. Um, my morning routine, so just again to recap, and this is it, I kid you not, 120 seconds. Um, oh, good, everyone loves the radiance oil too. I love the radiance, that rose hip seed is so good. So I wash my face at night, I swipe with my prep pad, then I apply my little Glow Pro technology, aerate the garden, then I put on the nightly, so cleanse, prep the skin and stimulate the skin, then you're gonna treat it with vitamin A. 10 out of 10 skin experts, dermatologists, plastic surgeons will tell you, got to be using retinol vitamin A at night. So this is deep release. It's a patented formula. Even if you have sensitive skin like me, you will love this amazing firming results. And then you want to seal it all in with that hydration. So that's where the quench comes into play. I need more hands. I need more hands. So it looks like this, something like this. I'm sure there's like a more elegant way to hold this, but that's it. Those are your four steps. Boom. Screenshot it. Done and done. That is my nightly routine. So easy. So let's talk morning. What happens in the morning, right? In the morning, Here's all you have to remember. At night, vitamin A, retinol. In the morning, vitamin C. There are so many different ingredients. It is so crazy confusing, right? So that's why I feel very much a responsibility just to help break it down. So vitamin C, vitamin A, they're not all created equal. That's where we're talking about some of the nuances to look for. Um, and sun protection. 90% of aging, let this marinate, 90% of aging comes from sun damage. Is that not crazy? Like even 10 minutes 
going to like take the trash out or grab your mail. So sun protection every day of the year is super important. I love the Perfector. It's zinc oxide, titanium dioxide. It is awesome. It has a tint to it. And it is what we call anhydrous, which means there's no water in it. So it's an amazing formula that creates a physical barrier, right? Like think about it, someone who carries an umbrella around all the time to block the sun, physical barrier, zinc oxide, titanium dioxide. I don't, that's my preference over a water-based formula. A water-based formula, your body wants to drink water, always absorb. So some of that gets absorbed into the skin, right? Which is why I prefer an anhydrous or water-free version. And it is also the most incredible silky texture. It's so fab. So I'll wear that as a foundation because it's tinted. Um, I love the Tarte Under Eye Concealer. I don't know. Um, I have got that question a lot. It's fab. Um, but that is an important part of the morning routine. So in the morning, I'm washing my face, same cleanser, straight up. If I'm feeling super lazy, I'll just swipe a prep pad. And that's great. Kills the bacteria. We sweat. I know it's gross so much at night. So you'll end up, that's why you end up with a lot of congestion here because you're sweating and it kind of coagulates in this area and then you break out in large pores. So just even just swiping a prep pad is great um, in the morning. And then, so now we cleanse the skin and just like all of our skin, like I said, right? If you cleanse, that's when you apply your serum. So you're going to go the thinnest to the thickest always. So now we're going to apply the daily vitamin C serum. And since I already put on my nighttime routine, I'll just put this on the back of my hand so you guys can see. And I want you to notice, look how thin this formula is. So we'd say, we'd say that it has a very thin viscosity. That is good. That is true to high potency vitamin C. Now, most vitamin C is made with ascorbic acid. So you guys can look at your vitamin C that you have at home if you don't use the daily. What does acid do? Acid eats. So literally when people are like, oh my gosh, my skin is burning. I was using this vitamin C. I'm like, yes, I totally know. Turn over the back. Is it made with ascorbic acid? And 99% of the time it's a yes. Um, and if you think about that, the higher the concentration of vitamin C, the more intense that feeling is. So if you've ever had your skin burning from vitamin C or red or blotchy, it's probably ascorbic acid. And it's probably a pretty high concentration. And look, 20 years ago and having grown up in the industry, that's all we had. I used it right along with you, that, that's it. But science has advanced. So now we have magnesium ascorbyl phosphate, which is acid-free vitamin C, acid-free vitamin C. This is a top seller for us at all of our retailers. I love it. And it's like a pump a day keeps the wrinkles away. It's awesome. So in the morning, and you guys, you've seen me do that demonstration before where I'll cut an apple in half and I'll coat half of it with two pumps of this and the other half not. And the half, the half I don't touch literally is like oxidized brown. And the other half with the daily looks pristine. Why? It's so hard to understand free radical damage. You can't see it, right? Doesn't mean that it's not there, but it's, it's hard. This is an amazing antioxidant protector against free radical damage. So why is a morning skincare routine important, right? We're doing the treatment at night and stimulating the skin and putting all the things in the morning. If we're not helping to protect kind of like your Star Wars shield, it's almost like if you were walking on a treadmill, eating a hamburger, right? because you're doing damage during the day without sun protection, without doing anything. And then at night, you're just kind of running in place, right? I call it running in peanut butter. So it's really important in the morning to help protect the skin. So we're washing our face, then we're applying vitamin C. Then I am obsessed beyond words. I, can, I am like blown away with our, the sales of Zen Bubble. I can't even believe it. It's just been a, so explosive. So I'm so glad that you guys are loving it. Thank you, thank you. Then I put on Zen Bubble Gel Cream and then I finish it off with my SPF and I can't hold everything. So that, those are my four steps in the morning. You saw my four steps at night? There's your, well, including prep pads, I guess it's technically five, but that's it. It is so easy. And then sunscreen would go right here if I could hold everything. So what I love about Zen Bubble, guys, it is, here's the secret. And I will tell you, I learned this from our team at Sephora. I had no idea. So thank you. I learned so much from our team. It is the most amazing primer ever, like amazing. It's made with Sika and Sika, another name for it is tiger's grass. Tigers brush against this grass in the wild and it heals their skin after wounds and so forth. So if you have red skin, irritated skin, highly sensitive skin, you'll love this. And what's so amazing about this formula is it is the first formula as a moisturizer that gives you 
clinically proven. You know, we do all third-party clinical testing. I love Bioscreen, several labs throughout the U.S. that are awesome, amazing. 65% more hydration while also controlling oil. That is amazing. You're not choosing, you're not zoning like this moisturizer here and it does it all. It's like the smartest moisturizer ever because it's controlling oil, oil-free formula and giving you the hydration, but so, so lightweight. So that's why I love using this lighter weight during the day because I'm usually running around and glowing from just sweat, running, doing all the things. And then at night, I'm using that yummy ceramide rich quench cream. So Zen Bubble, airless container. Most all of our products are made in airless container. Why? When you put your finger inside a jar, there's naturally, even if you wash your hands and I'm like a fiend about it, having you know grown up with my dad, Dr. James, who's like hand-washing expert, um, there's bacteria even underneath your fingernails. I know it's gross. And bacteria, not only does it cause breakouts, it actually, get ready for this, eats away your active ingredients. Think about that. So if you are paying for a 5% magnesium scrubble phosphate or SICA or the marine actives we have in this formula, you're not getting the same amount of those actives 30 days later, 60 days later. You might even, you might as well buy cold cream. And that's like one of the dirty little secrets that people don't know in the industry that I had to find out when I was literally working in the lab, one of our chemists, Terry, who I love. I'm like, wait, what? It's like, oh yes. Like, look at these Petri dishes. Look at these cultures. As you have bacteria inside here, the active ingredients start to disintegrate and they're not as powerful. So if you're paying for 5%, you want to end up with 1% or 0%. So outside of ceramides, that's why the quench is so awesome. I don't know where my quench went. Um, you don't have to have that same type of preservative system uh, because the ceramides are so rich. Just like you know, sugar is a preservative. There's the ceramide gives, gives you that beautiful preservation. Um, but for every other formula, it is really important. So you'll just push down on it. That's enough for your entire face. And I want you to watch how it goes from a cream and you feel, it's called Zen Bubble. You literally feel the bubble burst. So it's so, I can't wait for you to try this. Literally it goes, boom, I just felt it. It's like an ice skating rink. So you guys holla, give me a heart. If you love the Zen Bubble, I am so obsessed. And now because it's the most amazing primer, boom, we just saved 15 seconds, not having to put a primer on. Um, if you really want a beautiful glow, here's a little tip. I will cocktail the Radiance Rose Hip Seed Oil, which I love. I'll do a couple drops with Zen Bubble, or you can even do it with the SPF, the Perfector, and it gives you the most beautiful, like highlighted sheen, because sometimes it's hard to figure out all the highlighters, right? It's like, where do I put it? And you see it and all the things. So that is like nature's highlighter, but love Zen Bubble, cannot say enough. I get a lot of questions. Here's a question on redness. Oh, good, Kim, we just got it. Guys, don't forget to use the code. The code is HELLO2022 for 22% off tonight. And that's, again, you can't use it, I'm sorry, on Sephora's website or Ulta's website, just beautybio.com since we can, you know, control that piece. So hello, 2022. I understand it doesn't need all caps. And if someone just checked out and tell, tells me differently, but I hello, 2022, 22% off celebrating the new year. So please get your discount. I don't want you to pay full price. Um, so with the redness, this is one of the top questions that I get. I see it here. If you have redness in your skin, my sister just texted me yesterday. Here's the triple threat. Oh, I wish I had this image of, um, her name's Sarah. She sent me a picture. She works at a dermatologist's office. She's like, I've tried everything, Jamie. She's like, I have to write in and show you this picture because my redness is gone. And everyone at the derm office is like, what are you doing? She said, here's what I've been doing. The daily and Zen bubble. The daily and Zen bubble. That's my morning routine. Wash your face. Then I put on my daily vitamin C serum. Then I put on my Zen bubble. Finish with the SPF. That's it. So if you're someone that has that redness, that sicka, the marine actives, so, so good. Chlorella vulgaris, I know I'm throwing out a lot of terms, but they make me super excited. Um, amazing, absolutely amazing to calm the skin. So I love that. I love that formula. If you have redness, give that a shot. Rose hip seed is also great at helping to calm the skin. So if you want to put in a couple drops of the radiance, that's also only you know boosting results to that. All right, next, um, can you use R45 under your eyes? Absolutely. It's the only retinol I know of that you can use underneath that delicate eye area. And that's because it releases deeper. So most retinol, like think of when it was developed in the seventies, it kind of exploded on the surface of the skin, which was great because if you had acne, it kind of dried it out and helped to resolve and killed the bacteria and so forth. The challenge is most retinol formulation didn't really deviate that much. So we, one of the things that my family's lab is really well known for is making incredible clinical grade actives. So 
there's a, I, I won't name the names, but a lot of skincare lines that we formulated for over the years. And um, many of them, I would say the majority of what we've made are sold in dermatologist offices. And then of course, some in retailers next to us. We save the best technology for ourselves, which I love. Um, and I'll tell you that is a challenge with retinol. We're, we're known for our retinoids. And so what we did is we, and not to nerd out. So let me just tell you, we packaged our retinoid in a lipid or fat, like lipid suitcase. And then when it reaches certain enzymes lower in the skin that your body knows and recognizes it unpacks it. So we skip the entire inflammation on the surface part. It delivers into the skin, especially amazing if you just glow probe. So it really gets all the way down there and then it releases. So that's why you can use it under the eyes, around the mouth, because you're not exploding on the surface. It's awesome deep release retinol. So, so good. And it has other amazing hyaluronic acid and pumping ingredients. It's super yum. And we have a big launch, you guys, happening next month. More to come. Uh, so stay tuned, but super exciting stuff happening. I'm going to answer a couple more questions and then um, I'm going to jump because I've already gone longer than I said, but I've just been having fun with everyone. Um, Kimmy says, are the blush boxes continuing this year? Yes. They're so fun. If you do our subscription, um, every, every, I think it's every other month we drop a box, which is awesome. Oh, thank you, Britt. Best launches in the world. I love you guys. I just love our community so much. Thank you. Um, uh, Brittany Cooper says, any updates on the jumbo pack of prep pads? I know we've gotten requests to do a jumbo and we are working on it. So stay tuned, um, stay tuned a little bit later and you'll, uh, in, in a few months, well, we'll give you some updates there. Those are great questions. Um, skincare, Tina asks, does skincare help with dark spots? Yes, R45 and the daily are amazing for dark spots. Glow Pro is actually incredible for melasma and dark spots as well. Again, pumping up that new skin when it's birth doesn't have a spot. So I highly recommend using R45 and the daily specifically. Those are great for skin discoloration. If you are pregnant or nursing, I do not recommend using retinol. I get that question a lot. That's one that's here. Um, there's a lot of data that's split on once you're nursing. I used retinol once I was nursing, but to each their own, consult your doctor. Definitely when you're pregnant, no. So just stick with vitamin C, which is great because your skin is more photosensitive when you're pregnant anyhow. So many people get the mask of pregnancy. Oh my gosh. I remember I was um, pregnant and at Nordstrom for a speaking engagement. This is so embarrassing, but I'll straight up tell you. And so I had the perfector on my skin, which is our physical barrier sunscreen. And I was probably maybe like six or seven months pregnant. I totally forgot my chest, like not even at all. And again, being more photosensitive when you're pregnant, I, I promise you, it felt like a second degree burn on my chest. I'm like, how embarrassing I'm speaking to hundreds of people. So I just like tied this pretty scarf around, you know? And um, that's when I discovered the daily, I do not know why. So please don't ask me. I have no idea why the daily helps heal a sunburn. I don't know, but it is gold. Like on my kids, when we were on Bora Bora, I, I, it is amazing. So I don't know. I don't know what, what I, I would love to have time to study it more, but there, there you go. That's the tip. Um, so yeah, sunscreen, super important and photosensitivity when you're pregnant. There you go. So be warned, wear your sunscreen for sure. Um, I had some questions on work-life balance. So I'll answer that really quickly. And I'll start with, I don't have it all figured out. And please never look at me and think, oh my gosh, she just has it all. I don't. Some days I'm a really good mom. Some days I feel like a really good CEO and they're not usually on the same day and that's okay. And I think it's so important to give yourself some grace and, and just know that it's okay. You're doing the best that you can and just love yourself for that. And if you know that you could have done something better, then try again tomorrow. And, you know, we laugh as a team, we're talking about goal setting and so forth. It doesn't have to be January 1st to start a new goal or to set a new goal and just focus maybe on, on one thing if you feel overwhelmed and start there. I love picking a word and being really intentional with like, this is, or is it maybe you're going to be more present this year. And um, when we were out of town last week, I got off all devices until New Year's Eve and just really was present with my family. And it was so delightful. It was so nice. Um, so I'll share the thing that's helped me the most. Oh, I think Gracie has my phone. Um, calendaring. I know this sounds silly. I use, um, I don't love Apple calendars because it gives you one dot, right? Oh my gosh, that just happened, you guys. I literally just said Gracie has my phone and I'm broadcasting live from it. I'm just going to shut it down. Just going to shut it down and walk away. That's worse than the sunglasses on your head. Oh my gosh. Okay. I have my phone. So I can't show you the Google calendars. Download Google calendars if you have not, you guys. Here's why I love it. I'm a very visual person. 
on Apple calendars, every single thing on your calendar, every it creates that little dot, right? There, it's not a bigger dot or a smaller dot, depending on how much time it takes. So now I can look at my entire week at a glance. And if there's like big chunky meetings or things, I can stop and say, wait a second, do I really need a full hour for that meeting? Can it be 30 minutes? Um, and I can help just kind of trim the fat as needed. And that's been so helpful. So, so helpful. So I can immediately see, yep, I have a, a break here. I can pop in a 15 minute or whatnot. But with regards to motherhood and being a wife, I literally put in my kids and my husband, like I do a meeting, like just like a board meeting, it's in there. And that is really, for me, just giving me such peace of mind because I know that I am being delivered and I am fully present unless there's, you know, 911 um, with my kids at that moment or in the meeting or whatever it might be, super important. Um, the next is note-taking. So I'm a big believer. There's so many studies that show, even if you don't go back and reference a note, um, sometimes some of our team members will laugh because I'm like, oh yeah, in 2017, it was 43,000 units that we shipped, whatever. And it's because I have written it down. So if you feel sometimes um, some anxiety, perhaps I have found just writing everything down on a list. I actually love um, Apple Notes because it transfers all your devices. Just writing it down, like dumping it there. And you can just breathe and it's like, okay, how do you eat an elephant? Bye, bye, bye. Just gonna start ticking down the list. And that has really helped me. So I have, you know, mom world stuff I need to do and, you know, business and so forth. So calendaring, being deliberate, putting that time, like picking up your kids, literally putting it in everything's in the calendar. And then you just follow the calendar and just press forward. And then you have your list of stuff that you're ticking through. And that's really helped me a ton. Um, last question. Um, thank you, Alice. Love it. Yes, Britt, loving that too. So awesome. Um, so then last question, I had a lot of questions on diet and exercise. And I'm sure my team's laughing right now because I have like the worst nutrition. I really do. I'm like green juice and cupcake. Um, so I'm definitely not someone to model after, but I am doing better. And um, I would say in general, I, I, I do love green juices and, and that's an easy, fast way for me or protein shake. Um, I, I'm not great about having lunch. I don't have like a lunch break. I just kind of munch around sometime between like one and three. I usually like throw something down the, down the hatch. Um, today it was a protein shake. I think I love the Alani protein shakes. There's one that's like fruity pebbles or fruity loops or something like that. It's really good. And um, I love in Dallas, the juice bar has, uh, it's called the sea blast and it has kale and like really vitamin C rich, which I think is great. And then usually dinner, um, I'm not like, I would choose, and you guys can message and tell me, I would choose sweet over salty. Like my sister, Lindsay will eat, like if she's going to indulge, it is like chips and queso. That's not my jam as much. I'm going to go for a cookie or a cupcake probably. Um, so dinner, I'm not a huge, like pasta or bread, just naturally person. So typically it's more of a protein and vegetables. I do love like mashed potatoes or French fries or whatever. So I'll totally go there. Um, and then it's true. A day is not a day. I don't, it's like super embarrassing to me. I don't know if I've ever gone a day without having something sweet. I'm sure I have, I have to have, right. Um, but I do love you just, you know, a bite or two of something. Um, yeah. Okay. So I'll take a couple more questions, you guys, and we'll start here. Um, the ultimate, yes, I've had a lot of questions about the ultimate vitamin C cream. You can get that on our website if we have um, inventory. I know it kind of goes goes in and out um, of stock, but I'm glad that you love that. That's a great moisturizer as well. I've been tending more towards Zen Bubble um, just to help uh, keep my skin. I, I'm one that tends towards having a little more redness in my cheeks, and it's really, really helps even my skin tone as uh, Zen Bubble, but I love that formula as well. Um, we have a question, will we ever come out with a blue light to help with acne on Glow Pro? Stay tuned, stay tuned, that's all I'm gonna say. Stay tuned for another few months. Um, is the nightly available in Canada, asks Jenna. I think it is. I think we, our website now ships to Canada. You guys, that's big news. We ship to Canada now. I had a question if we ship to Italy, um, I will find out. I will make a note of that and we'll find out if we ship to Italy um, on our, our site. I feel like we do, but I could totally be wrong there. Um, yay. And yes, yeah, Suzanne says moderation is key. Amen says that. I live by that, love. Um, okay, so I'll take one more question here. Um, does the lip filler help get rid of hyperpigmentation on the lips? Great question. Um, I don't have an answer for that because I've not, I hate to say yes or no when we haven't done a full clinical um, test or panel on it. Um, in theory, yes, because I imagine you're talking about the, the skin surrounding the lips and skin is skin here or here. Yes, there's different skin densities, which is why we have different attachment heads with different needle lengths and shape and so forth. 
and the lip attachment attaches onto your glow pro. So guys, all attachments, no matter what, no matter what in the world, um, color model glow pro you have all the attachments will work. So you're totally good there. Um, okay. I'm going to wrap it up. If there's, I know there's so many questions I didn't get to, and I was really trying to get to everything. So you guys just, you can DM me and ask any type of question that you have, but I love you. Happy new year. I'm so excited. So grateful that you're part of our glow community. Um, I know we have a glow community that just started on Facebook. So you guys can check that out and join. If you want to know, like as of the moment updates with what's happening. Um, but thank you again. I'm, I will try to save this live. Um, and hopefully it'll answer some questions, but you guys are amazing. I could not, I would not want to do what we're doing without you. So sending big hugs. I love you and so excited. There's lots of great things happening. Do not forget to use that code. I don't want you to pay full price. Hello, 2022 and sending all of my best to you and yours this new year. Let's get it. Let's make it happen. Love you guys. Bye.